Hey everyone, Becky from Week 99 are here again. I have a really great item that came in from Bradford Exchange. Now this is for our holiday gift guide. And they sent us a few options and I sent them a few back that I liked. And they sent me this one by their choice. Now this is pretty much all of the holiday decorations I need in one box. And I'm excited about this. I've only seen pictures of it online. I haven't, I'm having a hard time opening this box too. I haven't been able to um, see this one put together. This one is a collector's item and it does come with a certificate. So the first thing in the box is a certificate for authenticity. This is, again, from Bradford Exchange. Let me get this out of here. So it's Certificate of Authenticity and it's the wonderful, wonderful World of Disney Christmas tree. And it has a sculpture number and everything. It is a handcrafted, hand painted piece. It is individually done. Um, so let's get into this and see if it's something that we want to have around for the holiday season. Um, not just this year, but next year too. Now, if you watch our channel at all, you know that we love Disney. So that is not going to be a shock at all that we have a lot of Disney ornaments throughout our house. Not all of them come in a package like this. Of course, it's all taped again. So thankfully, I have not put my, uh, knife completely away. Um, so. Okay, so I did stop recording just for a moment. Um, using the knife on the styrofoam and the tape was horrible on my ears and I didn't want it horrible on yours too. So this tree is from Hawthorne Village and it's the wonderful world of Disney Christmas tree. Um, it is from originally 2008 and it comes mostly in one piece. So look at this thing. Look at this here. So I will take close-up photos of this. Um, we do have, it looks like a power piece. And then we have Mickey Santa over here. So if you look right at the top, we have Cinderella's castle. How adorable is that? I'm not sure if it'll focus better if I get it closer or not. So I will make sure that I do have good photos of all of this. Um, there will be a full review for the holidays on my site, um, this as well. So what this is, it has, it has packing stuff all over it. It has the princesses and their princes, and I'm trying to get, okay, let's try again. So up here at the top, we do have the Cinderella Castle. We know that, the iconic castle from Disney. And on the second layer here, we have all of, we have cats hissing in the background. We have all of the princesses and their princes. On the lower levels, we actually have these trains that go around the tracks. And I will have to show you those in just a second. I'm trying to get the extra packing material out. And making sure the cats aren't destroying anything as is usual. Now, at the top, I'm not sure where this is supposed to go. I'm going to have to look it up a little bit, but we even have Santa Mickey Mouse. He has six reindeer, and he has Pluto there at the very beginning of his uh, sleigh. So can you see that? It doesn't want to focus. So it does come with a little power pack. This does light up. Or no, I'm sorry. It doesn't light up. This does actually, I believe, play music, and the trains go around these bottom tracks. So let's see. I do have a power strip right next to me, so we're going to plug this in and see what this bad boy does. Now, I absolutely love the amount of detail on here. Um, if I look, I'm going to have to take video all the way around this thing to show you. Um, we have everybody. We even have Jasmine and Aladdin, the genie, and the genie's wearing a nice little scarf. And let's see. Plug this one, plug this one in. Okay, let me turn this down a little bit. I'm not sure if I can find it from here. So this is super duper adorable. So again, this is the um, Christmas Disney Christmas tree from Bradford Exchange. And I still have to figure out how to hook Mickey on top. But 
it has your main princesses right here in the middle. It has all of your favorite Disney characters, and these are the classic Disney. We have Pinocchio, we have Goofy, um, we have, this looks like it's from 2008 is when they first designed it. So it looks like most of the characters that they're covering are kind of the old and iconic Disney and the Disney princesses. This won't include the newer ones, obviously. Um, but you do have Cinderella and Ariel and Pocahontas and Belle and Snow White and Aurora. And then you'll have all of your other favorite characters all the way around. Bambi's on here. Dumbo's on here. This is, I believe, $199.99. This is perfect for somebody who is an absolute Disney fan like we are. Um, the only thing is you have to really love Disney. Or you can just use this as your only tree. Now, our regular Christmas tree is only about three feet tall anyhow. So I'm not really concerned this isn't going to compete for a lot of space for that. Um, the footprint, it looks like it's only about a foot across. But um, most of our little tiny tree is filled with Disney ornaments anyhow. So instead of actually pulling out the tree and decorating it, we can actually just pull this out and get Mickey on top with his sleigh and the reindeer. And then we would have our own Disney tree just ready to go. And it has all of our favorites. And they do, you know, they do spin around. The trains do go around the bottom. Um, I do have some video of that that I will be including as well. I was going to say I haven't seen a train in a while, but I haven't really been looking. Um, it does have parts that light up um, that I will show you in the videos as well. Um, and, but there is a lot of glitter. Um, it does look like it is pretty well set on there, so you won't have to worry about glitter getting all over your house. So again, this is the Disney Christmas tree from Bradford Exchange. Um, it is hand painted. Um, I'm not sure which details they actually hand paint or what part is actually hand done, but this is completely adorable. And this is gonna be in our holiday gift guide. So this is something I will make sure there are links to below as well as the gift guide. Um, we are doing a couple, we're doing several gift guides this year. Um, but this one will probably end up in the um, kind of geeky or the phantom style gift guide. So ideas and things that you can get for the people in your family or in your life that love this type of stuff. Now I'm curious, there is two different on buttons. And that one did something, I believe that one is just on without noise and then the other one has music. Links for everything will be below. Like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you guys next week. Bye.